I'm not the typical makeup collector that is, stays always at home <laughs> and orders everything. I prefer to spend my money on traveling experiences and that's why I think it's important to select uh, what you buy because it's important for me that I budget for experiences because that's built my life and personality. Hi, tomorrow we are leaving for a trip to Switzerland and I would like to show you, to share with you uh, the beauty case that I prepared with the makeup and skincare. So I managed to put everything in this small case. Yeah, it seems bigger than it is. Actually, this is my hand. You see how small it is. I'm quite proud of what I managed to put here. I cheated a bit and I'll show you why. So let's start with makeup. And this is why I cheated because I put this one by Charlotte Tilbury that is the instant look in a palette. You know, these kind of um, all in one palette. And this will be my main makeup item. Here I have everything. I have eyeshadows here. I have a bronzer, a powder, a blush and a highlighter. Powders that I like the most in this compact are the face powder, that is a classical Charlotte Tilbury one. However, this is a tad uh, darker and peachier than uh, her fair shade in the regular line. The con of this palette is that the bronzer is not so lighter than this shade here, so I would have liked this to be darker. But yeah, it's not a problem. I can cope with it. This is perfect for all the events I'm going to attend. I am going to meet friends there. So um, there will be a lot of social activity that I will cover with this palette. After that, my other makeup items is a concealer. I have this by Jeffree Star. I have to say it's a nice concealer, it's elastic. Of a formula and I, I don't like to promote this this brand it's just one concealer that I would like to finish and it's a high quality so it's fair to say that this is a good concealer I want to finish this and that's why it's here then I have uh, this makeup item that is my beloved <laughs> uh, Chanel um, Ombre Premiere in Patin Bronze is my perfect bronze. I'm really in my bronze face now. I like everything bronze on my eyes. So this is going with me. Also, um, this formula is something that um, is going to dry out. So I want to use it up as much as I can. And that's why I'll bring with me. I don't know why I put this here because I mean, I don't need a lot of a primer, but there's this Pat McGrath Artistry Wand. Yeah, I may pick it with me if I don't want to use. I will tend to use this as a base, so as a primer. But if I want something transparent, I will use this artistry one. This is a recent purchase. And the last makeup item, yeah, no, other two makeup items that are these two is a mascara. This is it's becoming one of my favorite mascara. It's so inexpensive, and um, yeah. It's not my favorite wand out there. It's a straightforward, you know, straight wand, but it does a good job. And yeah, uh, I think I will repurchase this. I'm quite happy with this Essence Princess, Lush Princess Mascara. And I have my beloved Suku eyeliner. That will be my black eyeliner. It has been longly discontinued, but it's still going strong. It doesn't irritate my eyes, so I'll continue to use it. And then I have brushes. So I picked brushes that could fit into this small uh, case. And the ones are these uh, BK Beauty uh, brushes. I have the foundation brush 101. This is a travel size set. And what I like from this travel size uh, is that the heads are exactly the same as regular um, regular brushes so not they are not compromised in quality they are exactly the same and the only difference is that the handle is shorter and so they fit into this case so i have the foundation brush 
I have um, two eyeshadow brushes. These are the uh, 202 and um, 203. And um, then I have this Viber Rouge because I used to be a Viber Rouge in uh, Sephora. It's uh, anyway the Sephora Pro 56.5 brush, synthetic. I will use it for blush because this will be my foundation one and this will be my blush one. And uh, then I have this uh, Sedona Lace bra brush, this EB09. This is another one that fits here. Uh, not sure it would maybe it was a travel size. I purchased these I think in 2015, so it's a lot of time ago. So I don't remember. I may have purchased a, a travel size. That's why it's a short handle. Uh, so these fits um, my needs for brushes. These four. I out of these I will use this Sedona lace for the high shadows. Uh, this to blend eyeshadows, this for concealer, and uh, this for, again, concealer, powder, and blush, all in one. Uh, then we're done with the, my mm, makeup. Anyway, you may wonder, where is the foundation? I don't need foundation because I use concealer, and the main foundation is my SPF. So my main foundation would be this. That's the Tatcha um, travel size. I don't know what happened here, but it's a Tatcha uh, silk sunscreen. It's not my favorite sunscreen. I need to, uh, yeah, make an updated video because I used a lot um, every day. I have to say a few of these new SPFs, and I have my thoughts. Uh, this is not my favorite, but it's a travel size. It's very convenient, so very, yeah, you know, light. I will let wait on and I will use it. And then I have the skincare here. I have this old bite lip balm. I have to finish it. So here's that. But let's proceed with order. So first the cleanser. I have this amazing revision brightening facial wash. This is great. So this will be my facial wash. I think I will finish it up uh, during these three days. Then for, let's say, toner, I want to use this Essence SK2. Never you never tried. I have a couple of travel sizes from a Sephora purchase, so I uh, want to try this. And then have a couple of uh, serums. So I have, uh, again, my La Mer that I only use. Uh, my La Mer travel sizes, the ones that have, um, they are still not empty that I need to finish. And uh, this is eye serum, this is a matte lotion, and this is another soft lotion. So these are light moisturizers, and this is for eyes. And then I wanted a cream, and the best for me is this one by True Treatment, is the Omega 6 Healing Cream. This is one of my favorite. The only con of this is that it is that the best fragrance. Otherwise, it's an amazing cream. So this will lock all of these uh, serums. And I also have another, since these are quite, I don't know, I don't rely on La, on La Mer uh, when it comes to vitamins or, you know, actives. So I also introduced this one. It is a, a retinol serum, uh, again, by True Treatments. I have mixed thoughts about these. Uh, I mean, um, these are great, but I now, this used to be my favorite brand, but I don't trust it as I used to in the past. So I will maybe do a detailed review. It seems that my skincare videos are not so, you know, <laughs> popular, so I don't know if I will do it, but let me know in the comments if you are interested in, uh, in knowing about uh, true treatments. I have a long-term experience, let's say, with this brand, so let me know if you, you want to know more. And then some samples for, uh, you know, uh, <laughs> perfumes. And I have a Associage 
Uh, guys, I'm one that uh, do not receive house of sillage um, perfumes for free, of course. Um, I buy it by myself and I have to say, uh, these are snobbed, <laughs> um, but deserve more love and more purchases. These are nice fragrances. So this is one of my favorite, it is Whispers of Time. I have also a travel size, this is a sample size. And uh, this other one is a Jo Malone that I uh, picked up for layering. Uh, this particular one is Peony and Blush. I have tens of these. I have the full set of these. And maybe in the future I will uh, talk about these kind of uh, perfumes. Uh, I like these kind of um, colognes because they are not so invasive as other perfumes. And I think this is very respectful for other people. Because sometimes you want to create an impact, but you um, can become a little bit, you know, annoying. So I pay a lot of attention of the perfumes I want to wear. And uh, these are great, in my opinion, and they are longer lasting than I expected. I think until now, this is my favorite, but I need to, um, yeah, use them more and, um, yeah, express my opinion once I have clear ideas. So I hope that this was helpful for you and I will let you know um, if this was enough or if it was too much. I mean, for three days should be more than enough. I can even uh, remove something. Until next time. Bye bye.